No. WFXR Sports. Well, good morning, everybody. I am Ryan Moy, Jermaine Farrell, right here at the Capital One Arena in Washington, D.C., the DMV. I'm all about that DMV life. Well, as we are here at the ACC tournament, we did see Virginia Tech bow out, but the only thing that we have left right now is that number three seed. Isn't that correct, Jermaine? That's right. Virginia Cavaliers, they will tip off action tonight, mm -hmm. a late night, so probably get your coffee going. They'll play the last quarterfinal game at 930, thereabouts, but the way the tournaments were going, 930 is an approximate time. Yeah. But speaking of things that were not approximate, the Virginia Tech Hokies, a tough loss mm -hmm. yesterday, 86 to 76 to Florida right. State in the ACC tournament. And Ryan, that game had so many swings. Tech had a, a decent sized lead. Mm -hmm. Florida State would take a decent sized lead, and they were back and forth. And then Florida State at the end, they just pulled away. Oh, yeah, that, that was pretty much what happened. I mean, Sean Padilla, he was trying to get it going in the first half. He he was able to kind of get to the bucket a bunch of times, but it was almost as if, you know, they, it was two sides of the same coin. Florida State, though in the second half able to kind of get it going but the 50 50 balls is what really kind of did it in they were getting those second chance opportunities for Florida State just to be able to continuously get some points off of the board uh, just trying to stay together as a team um, you know it's a game of runs they're gonna make their run we're gonna make our run but like which team can stay composed and you know stay together um, you know not not getting down on each other you know we turned it over I think twice and they went up uh, everybody came to the hustle with positive energy of course you're gonna be down on yourself at the time but you know teams that stay together make it far just you know kind of remember this feeling um, you know in, in postseason basketball every possession matters um, you know we, we kind of lackadaisical a little bit on our on our game plan um, and had had a little bit of slippage um, but just kind of moving forward trying to trying to limit that um, and just kind of I guess play hokey basketball. Yeah, it's always frustrating um, losing regardless um, if you have an advantage or not. Um, but also just having those fans out there for the support and not being able to um, win for them, it definitely sucks. Obviously, it's just uh, kind of still raw right now. So kind of just do whatever we have to do, get back, and then we'll make our next step. Well, Ryan, like I said, I mean, this was a, a tough one. But like I said, they have opportunities for postseason play. And of course, tonight, as you mentioned before, right. Virginia Cavaliers, they'll be in action in the ACC tournament, the late nighter at 930. Absolutely. And we'll check it out. We'll have all your action from Capital One Arena. I'm Ryan Moy. This is Jermaine Farrell, WFXR Sports. And your consumer alert this morning, a major announcement from Chesapeake.